when we fix an aneurysm, we essentially remove the disease segment of the aorta and replace it with a prosthetic one, an artificial one. In general, there's two ways to do that. One is with open surgery, where we make an incision in the body cavity where that diseased portion of the aorta lies. We cut that section of the aorta out and we sew in the artificial aorta, which is uh, made out of a decron or it's a woven polyester material, and we suture it in position to replace that disease section of the aorta. Or, if it's in a portion of the aorta that's amenable to a less invasive approach, or what we call an endovascular approach, we deliver the tube of cloth into the aorta from a remote location, like a small incision in the groin. And after sending a wire up into that diseased portion of the aorta, using an x-ray to visualize what we're doing on the inside of you, we deliver a tube of cloth that's squeezed into a catheter into position and then release it so that it's held in place by metal stents that are attached to the aorta. Just like this one here, you see an aneurysm of the descending aorta with what we call a stent graft inside. This is not just a stent, but a stent graft. The graft is the tube of cloth that we use to replace the aorta with. And if it's an open surgery, it's just a graft. If it's an endovascular surgery, it's a stent graft. Depending on where the aneurysm is lo located, we'll predict which sort of approach we use. If we think that it will be a durable repair and it's safe to do it less invasively, that's usually the first choice. Uh, and that's true in a lot of aneurysms that involve the downstream or distal or descending portion of the aorta. When it involves the first portion of the aorta, most of the time we have to do it with open surgery. And oftentimes that also requires stopping your heart or interrupting or modifying the blood flow to the brain. Either way, we can treat all the portions of the aorta very safely, sometimes even in combination with both open and endovascular approaches.